Hey, my legion, how y'all doing today? If you know me and you watch some of my videos, you know my absolute favorite cooking show is America's Test Kitchens. And then it has like a sister show that I found out about it whenever uh, the Create channel was formed called Cook's Country. Both were co-founded by Christopher Kimball. And Cook Country has filmed in his home in Vermont. And apparently my one friend on, uh, one subscriber friend, William, uh, William M. was asking me about what do you think about him leaving the show, Christopher Kimball. I didn't know anything about it. And then he uh, he told me about that and he sent like an article, a link to an article about that in the Boston News about him leaving, Christopher Kimball. Uh, it seems like he's leaving uh, America's Test Kitchen immediately. You know, it comes two months after the company's got its first ever CEO. And it says the media, the Boston Common Press says, uh, the parent company of Mary's Test Kitchen, which says the two sides weren't able to agree over Kimball's contract. I guess they weren't offering him enough money, and he got mad and he decided to leave. Just like uh, I remember Ron Ebert left his show when Disney uh, was going to get renew his contract, and he looked at what he was going to give me. He said, that's an insult. He left the show. Uh yeah, it said they, they said the 2016 season of the TV show The Marin Test Kitchen, The Cook's Channel airs normal with Kimball. Cause I guess he finished shooting them in uh, September or something like that. And uh, yeah, it said that the show has over 2 million, if I'm not mistaken, over 2 million, uh, million weekly viewers. The Marion's Test Kitchen is the most watched cooking show on public television, PBS. And it's the best show out there. Uh, I don't know if it says it sticks to the recent broadcast schedule of the show will launch its 16th season in January. I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, said in September, Kimball has just finished taping the ninth season of his, of his other show, Cook Country, as home in Vermont. Uh, wow. Well, I don't know. I mean, if they have a new host of Test Kitchen and Cook Country, uh, I'll let you know about it, and I'll give you my review of uh, if they're any good. But, I mean, it's a real shame to see Christopher Kimball to go again. He was, like, the main guy, you know, because I was used to seeing him. And I didn't see him really anything else. They had something on CNN about school lunches or something like that. I think he was doing commentary on that uh, for someone seeing him. I know my dad said, Jason, yeah, see is Christopher Kimball, because my dad knows I like the show. Sadly, my dad, you know, he passed away and, you know, I don't know. I don't know if he was a big, as big a fan of the show as I was, because I love uh, Test Kitchen and Cook Country. But this is sad news. Christopher, Ki Christopher Kimball is leaving the shows. But I think that both the the new seasons are already done with him in it. But if they have anyone to replace him, I'll let you know what I think of the new host. But I don't think they'll ever replace Ki Christopher Kimball because he was a good guy, a good host. And he's been doing the show for I don't know how long. He's like 64 years old, and he was always, I don't know how he'd be so skinny. He does all that food tasting and stuff like that, right? But sad news for America's Test Kitchens and Cook's Country. So until next time, take care of my legion.